Hi everyone, so the next Diablo 4 quarterly update is out and this has been a quite curious one. So this one talks specifically about sound and sound design in Diablo 4 and at least for me this has been a very interesting read because I have never really given too much thought to that topic. First of all also they introduced a new game director who is Joe Shaley, apparently a veteran in the uh, WoW and Diablo teams. He has worked on Diablo 3 since the start and also various WoW expansions as far as I know. So I've read up on him quite quickly. Seems to be a pretty welcome choice. So good to see that things are moving on there. And they talk a lot about the atmosphere in the game, how the sounds immerse you in the world and how the monsters uh, give you cues and how you react as a player for the actual gameplay elements as well. And they give a lot of little like uh, sneak peeks into the world and how everything feels and sounds. So that's pretty cool. For example, they have some pretty much hour long ambience recordings here. Uh, for example, this is a little scene from the Fractured Peaks, which is one of the zones that is going to be in Diablo 4. And uh, you can just watch this bonfire and listen to the sounds of the wind and the snow. And it's actually pretty relaxing, so I actually did that while reading this whole blog. And I can just recommend that if you want to go through it, you have the link in the description. Just turn this on and uh, it was actually really nice. All the little like crackling, sizzling, blowing sounds. And uh, for me personally, it was actually uh, cool to uh, focus a bit on that. At least I really enjoyed that and it really opened my eyes a bit to that part of the game design that might be very well overlooked quite easily, at least for me. For example, I also play a lot of games just without sound or listening to music and these kind of things, but having a bit of like a sharpened sense to this might not really hurt so much. Yeah, there's also a few uh, little showcases of how they actually recorded these sounds and also what, uh, for example, some skills sound like. Uh, so here's like a little recording session where you can watch them like throw rocks and scratch things and uh, like you wave with fire and these kind of things. So um, yeah, pretty cool stuff. And also like how this actually gets transformed into the game engine at the end with like some of the uh, sorcerer skills here with a firebolt and the inferno skill actually looks pretty amazing. It's just like some fire snake. That you can summon. And uh, some other also really cool stuff here. I think my favorite part is probably this here where there's like a studio session and they try to make like disgusting, mushy sounds of yeah, gore and, and other things that can be used for like monster effects and uh, it's really interesting to see their creativity in some of these cases and then also how it actually transforms to the game in the end. So they show this here where you fight like some of these enemies and it sounds like this. Apart from the Fractured Peaks ambient sounds they also released a few more which is uh, Dry Steps and the Skillsglen Coast and the Skillsglen Rain. And those are also pretty cool scenes here, as you can see. Actually, the graphics are also really amazing. If you look at this, just appreciate it, like the, the sharpness and level of detail and like the little like animals running around and making sounds. Uh, overall, I think at least visually, audio, etc., I think they're doing an amazing job with this game. From we, what we can say, if you have also seen the other updates from this year and from BlizzCon, overall it looks pretty solid, I gotta say. And this is still like far away. I imagine they're gonna keep polishing, keep like just adding to the final product and I'm very excited to see the direction of which is it going. So this is pretty much it for this blog. Personally, when I read that it's about sound, I was not really very intrigued. But after having read it, I was quite glad that I have done so. So this was definitely one of the more interesting ones for me and I can just recommend for you to check it out. Click on some of these videos. I also have them all in the description along with the link to the blog. Just take some time and appreciate it. 
and I think it's, it's definitely valuable background knowledge. So let me know what you think. Hope you liked this little video and I'll see you guys next time.